Same dish, different recipes. From the most classic and iconic recipes into the most controversial, we're gonna try it. In this video, we're recreating something every rice lover knows, the great upcycling of day-old rice, the one and only fried rice. And today, we're trying three recipes, each from different people. Michelin star and celebrity chef, a personal favorite of mine, Gordon Ramsay. British chef and restaurateur, Jamie Oliver. And lastly, an internet sensation, Malaysian online persona, Uncle Roger, who actually criticized the previous two people. So today, we're pitting them against each other to finally answer this question once and for all. Who makes the best fried rice? Let's start with the simplest, Jamie Oliver's. He starts with olive oil in a pan, something Uncle Roger isn't happy about. And saute sliced spring onions, both the green and white. He adds pre-cooked rice or chilled cooked rice and tosses this around which coats it in oil and effectively fluffs it up. Jamie Oliver then takes out chili jam, which will add spice, sweetness, shine, and red color to the dish. He then adds a splash of water to plump up the rice. Technically, the water brings back some moisture to the rice and prevents the dish from getting too dry. Make some space in the center and crack in some eggs. Break the yolks and give it some time to coagulate because this recipe likes visible whites and yolk. Meanwhile, he admits the next ingredient is new. Are you ready? Firm tofu. He breaks this into irregular pieces and that will be this fried rice's protein. Season this with salt and give it a final mixing. To serve, coat a bowl with more olive oil. Fill it up with fried rice. Invert onto a plate. Jamie Oliver fried rice, done. The question is, how will it stand against Gordon Ramsay's? We'll see. Gordon takes out the big wok and coats it with oil. He didn't specify what oil, but let's assume it's neutral. Over high heat, in goes chives, chili, and galangal paste. He seasons this with salt, which will also soften the vegetables by drawing out the water out of them. He then aggressively scrambles in some eggs with a whisk and cooks them thoroughly. In goes leftover rice, which means pre-cooked and have been hanging around for some time. He seasons this with sambal, which is an Indonesian chili paste, and rendang, another paste made of a variety of spices including lemongrass, turmeric, and ginger. You'll also notice that Gordon tosses the rice in a wok. Finally, Gordon adds some sweet soy and salt to taste. Fried rice a la Gordon Ramsay? Served. But regardless of who you are, your fried rice has no escape from Uncle Roger. He starts with peanut oil in a wok. Uncle Roger first sautés shallots and garlic. He then beats some eggs specifically with chopsticks and pours that into the wok and cooks it until it's almost dry. In goes leftover chicken rice, which is rice cooked in chicken stock ginger, and garlic. He adds in some soy sauce which does not only season the rice, but similar to Jamie Oliver's water, it brings back some moisture lost in the frying process. He then adds sesame oil. This isn't an Uncle Roger recipe without MSG, which is gonna add pure umami flavor to the dish. And unlike in other recipes, Uncle Roger adds the chili and spring onions at the end, which cook them just enough to impart a mild spice from the chilies and allow the spring onions to retain a bright green color.
it's important to know that Uncle Roger's recipe doesn't have exact measurements, so I did my personal best to balance out all the ingredients. Now that we've successfully recreated all these recipes, or at least I think I did, we tried our best to follow the recipes as they did in their videos, and now it's the moment of truth. That's hot. That's hot indeed. It tastes very Asian, if that makes sense. I like it. It's kind of hot for my liking, but it's good. Walang kwentang comment. Kind of spicy for my liking as well, but I'd oh. say it's a good dish. Konyo. Konyo. I'm sorry. <laughs> Parang yeah. it tastes like sesame oil. I don't know if it's sesame oil that I'm tasting. I taste chili. Pero, <laughs> unlike these boys, I actually appreciate and like how it's so spicy because I love things that are very hot. It's weird. Para may tofu. Hmm? Yeah, may. Para may konting tofu. No, may tofu. This mm. is actually the first time I've ever eaten fried rice with tofu. Do you is like it, it? Is it tofu? I don't know. Is you it? said kasi tofu eh, so. Mm. Tofu ba or sago? Para na sa sago. Sago? Or taho? Taho. <laughs> Soy bean. Taho is tofu. Ah, tofu. Ano? Soy. Soy bean. Confirm ko yung hint. It has tofu. So mm. how do you like it? Yes, I love tofu. I love taho, actually. Nice! Pwede natin. Walang kwenta! Walang kwenta! Okay, sige. Oh, please hold on to your utensils. I like this one better. That was a bit weird for me, though. But I like the first one. Hmm. 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 I can taste the soy sauce and mm. the, I think it has oyster sauce as well. So it's very mapaet. Mm. Very tasty because I do like uh, bitter meals or like bitter type of food. This is the the fried rice that you'd, you'd order in a restaurant. The first two because I don't really see those type of fried rices in a restaurant. But this one is the traditional one. Is that a word? Which one? I don't know why. Rices? That's why I said, if you didn't see me, I did like that. Mm, like I didn't that. see you. I'm blindfolded. Wow. <laughs> the last one for me. It's very bitter, so and I like bitter food. I like the second one. Uh, it's sort of a familiar taste to me. Probably because of the tofu. Uh, as a person who loves like soy sauce and something that's made just spicy and like eggy and stuff, this is the one I like the most. Now we will reveal kung kanino yung dish na favorite nyo. Which Drum is the roll. third dish. It's from Uncle Raja. First one was a spicy one, no? It's Gordon Ramsay's recipe. Yeah. And then second one is Jamie Oliver. And both of them were roasted by Uncle Roger in, in his video. And actually, revelation is, when Uncle Roger released his recipes, it didn't have any measurements. Because he said Asians don't measure, it's just by feel. So hindi naman sa tayo nito ko yung credit ba? By what? Iba talaga pa. Pagsaing yan. Pagsaing. Pagsaing kung paano si Nagag. Well, para gumawa ng rice kila mo magsaing muna. Well. Uncle Roger, congratulations! You have the right to be. I love you, Uncle Roger. You're the best. I love you. Let's go. I love you, Gordon Ramsay. Gordon Ramsay, you like Uncle Roger's the best. Also, more realizations for today. Some people prefer other types of fried rice. For example, Jiro. Jiro, he likes tofu in his fried rice. So again, just like last time, all of these recipes are good, but at the end of the day, it all boils down to preference. That's it. If you guys want us to try other dishes in future videos, just drop them in the comments. And thank you for watching. See you guys next time. Asians, let's go, Asians. Let's go. Let's go.